After a fantastic visit with Greta and Kurt in Denmark, it was time to fly to Germany for the much-awaited Baltic cruise. Kiel is a port city in Germany's Baltic Sea coast and is also a long-time base for the German Navy and a high-tech shipbuilding hub. Our hotel was located only a couple of blocks away from the terminal where the Costa Pacifica would dock early in the morning on August 17th. That evening we enjoyed a nice meal at the Steingenberger restaurant and were joined by the two Jaimitos. This was the first sight of the Costa Pacifica from our hotel room balcony. Before embarkation, we went on a walking tour of Kiel's old town. The 13th century St. Nicholas Church is the oldest building in Kiel. Right in front of this medieval church is the Fighting Spirit sculpture by Ernst Barlack. Then we made it to the impressive Town Hall Square, where the 1911 Town Hall building stands proud, and next to it the 107 meters tall Kiel Tower, whose construction was based on one in Venice. The tower was under renovation when we visited so in order to complete this travelogue, I captured this picture of the tower from the internet. Let's take a closer look at the 1911 Town Hall building. The Sword Holder, sculpture by Adolf Brutt. The square is bordered by the Opera House and Kiel's Little Lake. We also enjoyed walking along the Holstenstrasse, one of the longest shopping streets in Germany. Here are some views of our hotel. Adorning the beautiful castle gardens is the equestrian statue of Kaiser Wilhelm I by Emil Hunt Dreiser. It is the tallest of the Kaiser Wilhelm equestrian monuments. The sculpture itself is 14 meters high. Then it was time to board the Costa Pacifica. Our cabin balcony had views of the port of Kiel 
and the German Navy Yards. Join Danish chocolate as we sailed towards Stockholm. On our first day at sea, we continued our navigation with a northeasterly route as we enjoyed a relaxed day on board the Costa Pacifica. Sì, 
Fertil i skulderen. Ja, 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 